The institution is under a coronavirus scare. There are fears that the number of positive cases may be more than the 33 claimed by the management. A further spread of the virus could have adverse results. We were left behind. So now tell me, if you want to close the university, who's at disadvantage? Who's, who's in the position of disadvantage? It's the black, it's the, it's the black child, it's the black person. The institution admits that it didn't have the best systems in place. However, they have made amends. We don't think we, we're going to be able, we're going to send people home. We're not going to do that. In fact, we're not. But the people that we talk to don't advise that. What we might do is then try to kind of, try to lock the campus down to an extent, right? To, to lock things down and refuse and, uh, entry and exit to certain kinds of people. So that's, that's what we think we're going to do. The SRC is adamant that the management could have handled the issue with more care. I've been calling uh, from the side of the university to say measures must be put in place throughout. One, uh, one of the complaints that we had, you only find uh, 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 plus minus 500 milliliters of a sanitizer, of 700 milliliters of a sanitizer next to the main entrance on, on, on some of these residences, of which is quite problematic. We are supposed to have these sanitizers floor by floor, kitchen by kitchen, bathroom by bathroom, because these students, they all share these things. Over a thousand students have been tested so far in both campuses of the institution. The institution is working with the provincial health department and higher education to keep the further spread of the virus. Yanga Funani, SABC News in Alice.